Hello, welcome to Monday. So, might have been like, okay, so I closed my shades today. Ha 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 that didn't work. I'm probably going back tomorrow. That's likely anyway. Today has been a really, eh, day. Nothing big has really happened at all. I was going back over my old vlogs and doing the Chinese localization, which is very minimal. Uh, but yeah, I'm just gonna go again. Might as well. I just gotta say, I don't know what's going on, why there's this path. Like, cause the thing is, it doesn't lead anywhere. You just go in that far and it stops. But if you look down, looks like the whole path has been trotted on a lot to make sure nothing, nothing goes there. Why? Why is there just this thing in the middle of the condo complex? Path to nowhere from basically nowhere. Like we're in the middle of a road here. What? is going on. Uh, also, today, we are planning on leaving this afternoon. We'll see how well that goes. I mean, we kind of do have to, but once again, we'll see how that goes. Good morning and welcome to Wednesday. This is a glass of uh, black tea mixed with um, lemonade. And it also, also the first thing I've had that can, that could, that contains a non-trivial amount of caffeine that I will drink since I was nine years old. I had, I had a Coke in a plane once, um, and mm, it didn't go well for me. I'll see if that happens. I definitely heard thunder. But, well there's some cloud cover. I don't see any rain. That's a little concerning. Just kind of frightening all out of nowhere. Well, um, should be fine. While I still haven't seen the rain yet, there's definitely signs of wind and such outside. Now, the reason why I'm thinking about this is that when mom returns, I was planning on going out and getting my passport photo, but I'm not going to do that if there's a thunderstorm going on. Also, <sighs> thunder freaks me out. Like, of course it does. It's loud sounds that are very sudden, like right there. Hmm. Turkey footage. Now we don't really think about turkeys here in the US until, you know, November rolls around, but like all of us, they exist at all months of the year. Well, it's thunderstorming again, this time with a lot more rain. I received something in the mail. And it was a little letter from a company that does laundry for students on campus. I'm doing this outside because I'm going to fucking yell. And I know my mom does not want to hear that. Basically what they do is that they advertise, oh, um, oh, you're going back to school. Hey, they're going to have to spend a lot of time doing laundry. Like they quote like a hundred hours or something, which I don't exactly know how long these payments are for, but that's kind of ignoring the fact that most of the time when you're doing laundry, you are not actually doing anything related to it, and you could be doing whatever you want. But, so, they're using this, this large number as a fright tactic. You don't want your kid to be doing laundry all the time at school, you want to be doing important things. So, let's handle your laundry for you. The cheapest plan is over $700. 700 fucking dollars. And the, they're, 
their quote-unquote most popular plan uh, is normally almost the thousand and one hundred dollars but right now you can get it for a thousand nine hundred and ninety nine dollars and like it's excessive like it's like oh you're gonna be having press suits or whatever like what the who does that I wear my suit like two hold on two times whole time I was at school you don't need to clean it after that you need to be paying 300 more dollars for that and then like on the back they're like oh we do this stuff for environmental protection and then they also say payment plans are available <sighs> they're fucking you know what they're fucking trying to do they're fucking trying to scare parents into spending money they don't have on their fucking laundry service fucking laundry service like you know, there's all these fucking bugs here because Anyway, that was my yelling fest for tonight. Thursday, um, uh, yesterday I had a glass of half tea, half lemonade. Uh, yes, that was correct. I thought I said lemonade twice. Today it's just straight black tea. Um, I burned my tongue earlier, so I put a bunch of ice cubes in it and just sort of walked away and sat on the couch for a while. <laughs> <sighs> we might have noticed I um, didn't record anything after that. Don't worry, I didn't, like, die or something. But I did have to go up to New Hampshire and... Uh... Have a dentist appointment and... A bunch of other things. It's been a very long day. I don't know if the caffeine did anything. Positive or negative. Hello and welcome to Friday. Um... I haven't done that much that I felt was worth talking about. But, uh, I gotta do something. It was the first time I flossed in a while and I brought my electric toothbrush, so hopefully that'll improve my dental hygiene and gums. I'm not downstairs because Dad's working in the other bedroom. Soon I'll probably do something. Man, I hate being... I said, okay, we'll call you back. And then, like, it's been a few minutes probably longer than someone would reasonably be expected to be on hold and uh, not getting a call kind of worries me because it really feels like it could be at any moment and that sucks good news we got the thing just need to shower um, that's not a good thing to have on your tennis court just a giant crack like, the weird thing is, it seems very localized. Like, you look around, everywhere ar besides around this area, and I guess, like, over there, isn't cracked? Which means that, like, it's something where, like, that wall over there is getting pulled apart from that wall. But that wall isn't getting pulled from that wall. Also, hi, and welcome to uh, Saturday. I, I figured out that I could go in here because someone just tossed the lock up to the side. I mean, I'm a, as someone who's supposed to be at this condo complex, I'm allowed here, but you know, they have a lock on it anyway. I don't know, really lock anything else? They lock the garbage, which I guess probably is more for the bears. There's not usually bears here, but there was a bear incident a few years back. So I can understand why they would want to lock that up. But, okay, this, this is weird right here. Why is there a gate here? Because you see, it goes right into woods and like you can barely make out something over there, maybe? Yeah. But like there's, there's locks on that door that no one would ever really want to use. I'm kind of confused about this. Also, they moved the basketball hoop in here rather than it used to be up there, which I guess is fine because that's actually a parking lot. It's not gonna be that long till I'm, I'm back at school again. And that means I'll be getting into the second year of the vlog. We'll see how much of the vlog I've posted by that time, you know, sort of like 
a report on how, how well I'm doing. Right now, I've been pretty consistent about getting one week out a week, but I also know I'm already behind. So I'm kind of thinking I should try to, when I can, step up the vlog production. Of course, I also have China, Chinese, Mandarin to study. Um, and that's not as, like, that's also something I need to get done. That's a little bit more important, but you know, it's now I'm not really gonna get it done. I know that. Everyone knows that I'm not gonna become a master of Chinese in six months. Okay, so you see that um, dock over there? Yeah, um, they used to have the docks here have like metal, painted metal as their cross supports, you know, the things you walk on. They decided to change them to plastic, and while I haven't been able to prove this directly, I swear to God those things flex. And like, there's two middle rails, and I, um, I'm like putting myself on those middle rails, um, whenever I walk on those as much as possible because it feels like it squishes with every step, and I'm just like, this isn't good. Who approved of this? Also, like, the other dock, the one on the other side, like, they used to have way more dock to it. And now it doesn't. And I'm like, did you rip out the old dock to put these up? Like, why? Maybe there's corrosion or something. I mean, that is the problem with using metal near water, but... Wait. There was, there's always been a, like, platform there for people to swim off of. Where did it go? Hello and welcome to Sunday. So, uh, let's break it down to two categories. Things I kind of should do, or at least try to do. And two, more Chinese. I have never felt really before how this much desire to just cram. I don't totally understand it, but yeah, I just want to cram. Honestly, maybe I should, but I also sort of thought to myself like, man, I should probably record some reactions or select a seat on planes or other such things, but throw myself at it, the language for like another hour or something, maybe a few more. I think I'm really excited about the trip. I think that's just sort of like taking over my mind right now. I mean, you can't really blame me too much because it was talked about a lot over the past few days with the plane flights and that sort of stuff, but yeah, it's a little bit of an obsession right now. 